Will the most important event in the world today happen in Washington, D.C.? Or in the district where your daughter goes to school? Sometimes we have to stand back so far to see the big picture. We lose sight of what's happening right before our eyes. But the stories that affect us most don't happen to countries or to companies or among skyscrapers in the city. Stories happen to people. And they happen in the community where you live. All you have to do is look around. That's what we do. After all, we live here too. News Center 4, 24 hour news. Our doctors struggling to provide the care you need. What's wrong with HMOs? Why does health care cost so much? Who really owns your health, your doctor or your insurance company? Starting Monday, News Center 4 takes you inside doctors' offices and hospitals to report this important story in depth. Get the answers that may affect your health, your future, maybe even your life. Who owns your health? Starting Monday at 6 and 11, only on News Center 4, 24 hour news. When New Center 4's Tom Sinkovitz left Vietnam in 1970, he thought he'd never return. Thank you very much, Bob. And more but 30 years later, he did. Just off a bustling Saigon street is one of Asia's best-kept secrets. I'm Pete Wilson. Tonight on New Center 4, join us for an eye-opening journey back to Vietnam. I'm, uh, I'm just kind of overwhelmed. Why? It's a voyage of emotional healing and unexpected discovery. Return to Vietnam tonight at 6 and 11 on New Center 4, 24-hour news. Are you from Palo Alto? Yeah, Gary. Once upon a time, I ran track in Palo Alto. Yeah? Jenny, I don't want to brag. I couldn't be caught like the wind. Boom, dynamite. That's great, Gary. Oh, yeah. Hey, didn't you win a gold medal in Barcelona? Two golds and silver, Gary. Boy, that makes a fella feel pretty good when he can keep up with an Olympic runner. I'm a swimmer, Gary. Get to know Jenny Thompson and other Bay Area Olympic athletes, along with us this summer at Cron. But you did win two golds. And a silver, Gary. Regina Jacobs is one of the fastest human beings on earth, a five-time national champion, the first American to win the World Indoor 1500-meter championships. And between two appearances on the U.S. Olympic team, she double majored at Stanford and earned an MBA from Berkeley. This summer, we'll show you a side of this Oakland native that few people ever see, the front. Steve, you're from uh, Saratoga, right? Right. I really enjoy these workouts with you Bay Area Olympic athletes. What can I do for you guys, though? I don't know. Make a donation. Or a little pin or something. Come on, I want to get involved. Well, there is one thing you could do. Just name it. Why don't you try pedaling for a while? Steve, you're the weather guy, right? Yeah. Funny, I always thought of you as an anchor. Today, the whole world changed when you weren't looking. You turned away for a moment to tend to your job or your family or to life in general. And when you turned back, nothing was where you left it. But change is what the Bay Area is all about. It ripples through the way we live, work and care for our families here, sending waves of change all over the world. Even the ground beneath our feet is restless. So much changes here in the day, it's hard to keep up with it all. Fortunately, you don't have to. That's our job. Because we're living in a time of miracles. In a place where miracles masquerade as everyday life. These moments are worth holding on to. We're here to make sure they don't slip through your fingers. News Center 4, 24-hour news. 